The Foodtable module for Drupal provides integration with the Foodtable jQuery plugin. The plugin makes it really easy to create responsive HTML tables that look great on small devices. Using a concept called breakpoints, you can define which columns should be displayed or hidden when the table is being viewed on a mobile or desktop. In this video, we'll look at the food table module for Drupal. The module integrates with views, and this allows you to create a table as well as define breakpoints. You can also use this module as an API and manually load the plugin for custom tables. First, go to Food Tables GitHub page and download the plugin. Extract the downloaded zip file into the libraries directory and rename the folder to Food Table. Once completed, the path to Food Table should be sites slash or slash libraries slash Food Table. Finally, go download and install the libraries API module and enable it first and then Food Table and Views. Now that we have everything set up, let's go ahead and create a responsive table using Views. The Food Table module integrates with Views via a custom display plugin. All we need to do is select Food Table as the display format when we configure a view. So go to Structure, Views, and click on the Add New View link. Call the view Food Table and select Food Table from the Display Format drop down list. Once you have filled in the form, click on Continue and Edit. Go ahead and add a few fields to fill up the table. For this example, I'll add the title, type, post date, and a trimmed version of the body field. Now all we need to do is define breakpoints for the table. This will notify Food Table if a column should be displayed. Click on Settings in the Format area and scroll down the page to the Food Table Settings field set. In this section, you can define breakpoints and choose the expandable column. Leave Content Title selected in the expandable column field set. Check the Phone checkbox for type, post date, and body. Save the settings form and the view. Now let's go to slash foo table to see the table in action. If you resize it to the browser, the type, post date, and body field should collapse. To expand the table, simply click on the plus icon, and that's it.